This video will demonstrate a standard procedure for obtaining a phosphine threshold value using transcranial magnetic stimulation and a method for mapping and recording the size and location of perceived phosphines. TMS is a non-invasive neurostimulation technique that is used to alter neuronal activity through the application of a brief magnetic pulse. The application of TMS provides a safe and non-invasive means for disrupting neuronal activity with a high degree of spatial and temporal specificity. When stimulating visually sensitive regions of cortex, a brief visuotopic sensation known as a phosphine is produced. The location of the initial point of stimulation is first identified. The center of the TMS coil is placed over the point of stimulation so that the handle is tangential to the surface of the scalp. The stimulation intensity is adjusted until a threshold value is determined. To record the observed TMS-induced phosphine, the participant is seated in front of the Laser Tracking and Painting System, or LTAP. A TMS pulse delivered to the right occipital cortex produces a phosphine located in the contralateral visual field. The participant is instructed to outline the perceived phosphine using a laser pointer. The path of the laser pointer is tracked using a standard webcam and recorded using the LTAP software. The laser path may be projected onto the projection screen so that the participant is able to gauge his or her accuracy. Results of the LTAP system confirm that the location of perceived phosphines is gaze-dependent, reflecting the small receptive field size and organization of the occipital cortex. Hi, my name is Seth Elkin Frankston from the Laboratory of Cerebral Dynamics in the Department of Anatomy and Neurobiology at the Boston University School of Medicine. Hi, my name is Peter Fried, also from the Lab of Cerebral Dynamics. Today we'll be showing you a procedure for how to obtain a phosphine threshold value.